sir. It's wrestling night in Iowa. Welcome to 3X Wrestling. I'm Midnight Guthrie, alongside the right price Aaron Masterson. And before we get to this week's action, as you know, we've noted before, the Rebel Jeremy Wyatt, our heavyweight champion, out with a broken leg. The title will now be on the line in the, the gauntlet for the Gold Battle Royal, our seventh annual one and the biggest one yet on May 25th in Des Moines. Yeah, everyone's going to be fighting and scrapping, throwing each other over the top rope here and looking for the gold in the end. You can get tickets for that event at 3xwrestling.com and all our ticket outlets. And also coming up for 3x Wrestling on June 8th, it's a Friday, we'll make our debut in Grimes, Iowa as part of the great Governor's Day's event with the Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase appearing. And on June 9th, a Saturday, we'll be at the Boone County Fairgrounds, our debut in Boone, Iowa. We can't wait to be there to show the great fans of Boone the great 3X Wrestling action. Yeah, don't forget to check out 3xwrestling.com for all the information. And now let's go to the matches. Ladies and gentlemen, Midnight Guthrie here with the right price, Aaron Masterson, as we get ready for fatal four-way elimination action, elimination style. Now, I do not know exactly about this fourth, the, this competitor, but I understand there's been a competitor added, and I know nothing no, about the No, to for the ring! The first wrestler in this elimination match he told me he hails from New Zealand, but that seems anthropomorphically impossible. Representing the Aspen Athletic Club, ladies and gentlemen, it's Zeus the Moose! Now, Aaron, you're, you were always a pretty wacky competitor, but there's a damn moose at the ring. And now, his first opponent! He stands five foot ten inches tall. He weighs in at 190 pounds from Pops of Pops, Iowa. Please vote. Dangerous J. Jason Strife. The ever energetic Jason Strife making his way to the ring. The incredibly hard hitting, hard striking Jason Strife. Undefeated in 3X Wrestling since November. He looks puffed. I wonder what he thinks of his challenger here, Zeus the Moose. Uh, well, did anyone in this match say they've wrestled anyone like Zeus the Moose? I, I can't imagine they have. Man, has, he's got antlers. Peterson's got the duties here. That's oh, boy. Right. I'm going to try to envy him. Who knows what you'll find in that moose's fur? Is he going to remove the antlers? That's my real question. I don't think he can. Oh. I don't think he knows what to make of him. The moose trying to get a psychological advantage already here. He's only got it over the ref. 
Now these guys don't want to lose focus here, folks. How can you be focused when you're in the ring against a six foot tall moose? He probably towers seven feet. Who am I kidding? Oh my god. Oh, my headbutt from the moose. Oh! <laughs> Twisted there. Unbelievable. The, the velocity on that headbutt, tremendous. Oh, charges the corner. Derek Corbin rolls up the moose. And there's the, the moose is loose. Are they, they chanting moose or are they chanting moose? Derek Corbin eliminates Zeus the moose. Maybe they're chanting Zeus. Zeus the moose has been eliminated. Ryan Slade quickly. Yeah, neck breaker. is very upset the moose is out of the match. I think they were all rooting for the moose. We know nothing about the, the training history of the moose, but uh, he didn't seem to have a lot of wrestling ability. No, he didn't. Have, he did have a good headbutt, though. I'm impressed he can get back up the ramp. Oh. Back to the in-ring action. Muda style elbow there by Jason Strife. Now this should suddenly become a high-paced, hard-hitting match. Oh, I fully expect it. I mean, these are three of the top competitors in the Midwest today. Now Ryan Slade and uh, Casey Strife, they challenged each other on the outside the ring. Yes, start. absolutely. And, and this happens at 3X Wrestling. Things were changed, obviously, sure. with the inclusion of Zeus the Moose. But Darren Corbin coming back, it's great to see him back. And he is very much a very good competitor in the world against these two. As I want to point out, Ryan Slade recently battled for the heavyweight title. Jason Strife is undefeated. This is a great opportunity for Corbin, a former tag team champion here at 3X Wrestling. Oh, a nice backbreaker by Slade. Slade. is clearly the biggest man in this match. Look at him. He's using his size to his advantage already. Corbin with a drop kick. That was Slade kicks out of both. It was interesting. He gave him a drop kick, but he ended up oh, strike a pinball. A lot of body weight there. It's Corbin. Toss hard out of the ring. Oh, kick to the midsection by Slade. Showed that. Irish whip reversal by Strife. He showed that. Oh, Slade rips him. You know what? A lot of guys use that drop oh, down. What a kick. A lot of guys use the drop down. You don't see a lot of trips. Mighty kick there by Strife. It's just his kicks have been devastating. He's devastated to spare. John Wentz, Ray Stryker, Ricky Kong. Jason Strife hits very hard. Looking for that German suplex. Strife fights out of it. Nice lock. Oh! Good. He's going for a Pele style kick. Good move from Slade. He's got him up. Look at this. Oh my god, that's it for the crowd support. Using that Aspen Athletic Club Fellowship. Wow. Oh my girl, the slam. Slade. What's this? Oh, what a splash. What high impact moves so early in the match. Well, Ryan Slade, a big fan of the Ultimate Warrior growing up. He turned his back on Darren Corbin. Darren Corbin. Oh, look at this combination. DDT stutter combo. He's got the advantage. Suddenly has the advantage here. Corbin still holds the record as one half of the longest reigning FXW Tag Team Champion from history. The North Star Twist held the belts for 20 months. I want to start a single streak. Now he's going up top. Oh, Strife really ragtagged him with that slap. What a move. That's a dangerous position to be in. Man, hold on. Now look at Ryan Slate might want to watch out here. He's trying to set up for a superplex? No way. Slate wisely is up. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. Tower of Doom. Tower of Doom. Man alive. Corbin is very hurt. That took everything out of Ryan Slade there. My God, he almost knocked all the color out of Corbin's tights on that one. Oh, here we go. Canadian Destroyer. Looking to get that. Oh, he nails it. He nails it with the Canadian Destroyer. Oh, he's got his back turned, though. Corbin with the Apollo roll. And Corbin eliminates Ryan Slade. And now Smartly goes right after Slade. Wow. Ryan Slade has been eliminated. Well, now Strife is going to be seriously hurt from that Canadian destroyer. He does. But that was so smart of Baron Corbin. They don't go after the guy who would have been easily pinned. Go after the guy that's well rested there. What 
a genius move. He almost won the match. Corbin, you know, he is a solid veteran at this point. You got to know, you know, that's the thing about these multi-way matches, these triple threats, four ways. You've got to be aware of what's going on at all times to take advantage of those openings. Down. What a two on or what a one contest this is between Corbin and Strike. Yeah, but if it becomes a strike fest, I gotta think Strike has the advantage. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Corbin's really gotta use that clever technical ability here. Wow, what an elbow there to the top of the skull. Uh oh! Didn't see his opponent right behind him there with a the close line. Good counter by Corbin. Oh, he caught the feet. Great move. As you know, Corbin or Strife likes to step on his opponent's chest from that. What's Strife doing here? Oh! Strife trying to get the ropes, couldn't get it in time. Oklahoma roll. Kick out by Strife. That was a close one there. What a big move there by Corbin. That's gonna really knock the wind out of you. Now the winner of this match is gonna get a huge bonus. I mean, you've been four guys, or three guys essentially. Corbin is calling for the ginger snap now. Oh, oh, what a chop. You can hear that back in the Capitol building. DDT nails it. What an DDT. That's Jason Strike wins. What a win for Jason Strike. You. Dangerous Jay, Jason Strike! He had to overcome three other men, including the Moose, to win this match. What about? Big victory for Jason Strife as he defeated, taking nothing away from Zeus the Moose, but we know nothing of him. But Ryan Slade recently challenged for the heavyweight title. Darren Corbin's as tough as they come in the Midwest. This has got to be put Jason Strife in line for a title opportunity. Well, let it be noted, too, Darren Corbin had a very good showing here tonight, pinning Ryan Slade and Zeus the Moose. Absolutely. Out of the three balls necessary to win. Great return for Darren Corbin as he offers the hand. Beautiful sign of sportsmanship here. Are you into WWE or 3X Wrestling? Then we have the place for you to hang out every Monday night and Sunday WWE pay-per-view events monthly. The Keg Stand in West Des Moines at 3530 West Town Parkway. Every Monday night you can hang out with 3X Wrestling staff and wrestlers while we watch Monday Night Raw. Plus the monthly WWE pay-per-view events including WrestleMania, Royal Rumble, SummerSlam and more. Friend 3X Wrestling and the Keg Stand on Facebook and we'll keep you updated. See you at the Keg Stand for wrestling, drinks and great food from Bach Catering. The other guys, they think they know what special means. At Godfather's Pizza, we do special, and we do it better. We add the tea. to a Godfather's Specialty Pizza with your name on it. Classic combo, all meat combo, hot stuff, taco, yeah, even veggie and more. All of them piled high with the best toppings and 100% real cheese. Treat yourself special. Order specialty pizzas from Godfather's Pizza. Everybody, it's Ted DiBiase, the Million Dollar Man, and I'm coming to Central Iowa. That's right, on Friday, June the 8th, I'll be joining 3X Wrestling in Grimes, Iowa for an annual event called Governor's Day. Man, come on down and join us because there's going to be a lot of entertainment, good old wrestling, and food. Oh, yeah, the Million Dollar Man, he loves his food. I'll be there emceeing this wonderful event along with the stars from 3X Wrestling, as well as riding the rides, participating in all the festivities. I'm the Million Dollar Man, so I'm going to be spending some of my money with those vendors, that's right. But most of all, the food, man. The Million Dollar Man loves that food. So if you want to get your money's worth, you'll come down there and you'll join us on Governor's Day. And if you want more information, please go to 3xwrestling.com or grimesiowa.com. And remember, everybody's got a price for the Million Dollar Man. Three XW Gauntlet for the gold. Casanova's bringing the title belt back home with him because he's the sexiest dude in Des Moines, in Grinnell, in 
a tumble. Wherever we go, the ladies all want me, and they'll want me even more if I got the belt around my waist. Yeah! Oh, Chris W., do you know who's, who spent the most time ever in Chris W.'s gauntlet for the gold? You're looking at him, baby. Delicious Devin Carter. I swear, I come in early and I stay late. And every time, at least most of the time, I've won like two or three of them. Check the books. Maybe it was just one. Todd Countryman threw me out. But that was enough. Anyway, I spent more time in that ring in the gauntlet for the gold than anybody out there combined. And that's exactly why I'm going to win the day thing for the third or fourth time or however many it is. I lose track. But I'm going to win it and I'm going to win the foul. Yeah. Here we go. It's a big time three X wrestling tag team action. And two of our top teams are going at it to determine the number one contenders for the tag team championship. competitors here at 3X Wrestling. Dana Carter and Casanova, not accompanied at ringside by Commissioner Todd Benjamin. They are all members of Genesis. Todd Gunderman took a pretty nasty spill in there. I thought Terry slow. Contest with very, very large implications. As this will directly determine who challenges next for the 3X Wrestling Tag Team Championship. I believe the young Peter Sellers fan at ringside is taunting Devin Carter. Casanova taunting the crowds. Well, stretching out, he claims. Tainting the crowd, if you will. Well, certainly their attitudes taint any environment they're in. Let, let, let Devin, come on, come on, Devin Carter. No, I can verify, she is a toothless old bag. Toothless or not, God bless this woman for supporting 3X Wrestling. John West, got his eyes firmly locked on Casanova. Joining forces with Matt McDowell has done excellent things for John West's career. Still really, in the early part of his career, now in his third year of professional wrestling. Headlock takeover there by Casanova. He brushed him there. Oh, he's just showing him who's boss. Casanova, a former 3X wrestling heavyweight champion. Actually, when you combine all the titles Casanova has held in their lengths of reigns, he's the longest reigning champion, the most decorated champion in the history of 3X wrestling. His partner, Devin Carter, a former three-time heavyweight champion. We saw earlier in this same event, it was Devin Carter and Matt L. McDowell, the final two of a battle royal, an impromptu battle royal set up by Todd Countryman. And Devin Carter eliminated Mad Dog to win that battle royal. Big battle royal coming up in Des Moines at the end of May. The seventh annual gauntlet for the gold battle royal. The winner earns a shot, a future shot at the 3 x heavyweight championship. But right now, John West is throwing Casanova all over the ring. And now applies the side headlock. Casanova throws a hard, big shoulder block. Face lock there by Casanova stops John West in the tracks. Reversal. John West really using that power there. Oh, look at that! Casanova was packing! 
You're a friend of Casanova's. How do you explain that? Wow! Yes! Love it! I have no idea what I just saw. <laughs> Body slam with a sock in the mouth. You can't, that's what happens when you break four objects, the ring side. Where is John West finding socks in a wrestling match? It was the Casanova's trunks. I don't, I don't believe that. That uh, McDowell tag in. Big clubbing blows. I know that man's size is all kind of What a headbutt! Look at the height on that. 302 pound powerhouse, man of a doubt. This incredible agility. John West, he's 250 himself, but he flies in the air like a bird. This is an incredible height. There's a lot of meat in the ring right now. Big charging splash. Nobody really needs to get out of there. Well, look at this. Slingshot to West. Oh, what another splash! Great technique. Casanova. This could be all. Kick out by Casanova. Two high impact moves. And the American Bulldogs clearly have the advantage. Casanova reaching for the tag. He's still 10 feet away. Quick tags in and out by the Bulldogs now. Oh. John West fights out. And Carter misses. Oh, sleeper hold has been applied. That's a The deep. beauty sleeper has been applied. Come on, John. And uh, McDowell might want to break this up. Ten minutes remaining in this contest. Ten minutes remaining. Ten minutes left. Ten minutes remaining. It would be very unsportsmanlike of Mad Dog McDowell to break that up. Well, look at this. John West down to the mat. He's out. He might not have ten seconds left here. Might as well ring the bell now. Come on, John. He's, he's got it. I think that hand went down. What? You saw it, Guthrie. No, absolutely not. Shot breaker. Pull of the as hair by John Ross. Makes the tag as he falls back. Devin Carter catches him. Oh, big insecurity right to the arm. He kicked him extremely hard there. Carter's arm may be broken. Brother, that was Randy vicious. John West on. Come on, John. Just reach your hand out there. You can do it. And he's got the tag. Please excuse oh, my partner's homerism there. Power slam. Cover. That's an over with the senton. Nails Evan Carter. Almost hit Jeremy Robb. Pass it over. Throw it outside the ring. This is where not having Todd Countryman at ringside with him is going to cause Wait a minute, tag is the John West. Look at this, he's going up top. Could it be? He climbed up backwards. Good saw by John West. Cover. And the Bulldogs are the number one contenders to the tag team titles. Todd Countryman would gentlemen. never have let this happen. Here are your winners, the American Bulldogs. This makes me sick to my stomach. And now the American Bulldogs go on to challenge the other established team of Genesis, America Ground and Air, for the tag team titles on April 27th in Des Moines. Sometimes in professional wrestling, one man's pain is another man's gain. While I hate to hear about Jeremy Wyatt's injury, I plan on making it my game. I plan on climbing to the top of 3X Wrestling next month, the Gauntlet for Gold, and the only thing that stands in my way of becoming the new 3X Wrestling Heavyweight Champion is 29 great superstars in professional wrestling. To tell you the truth, I kind of like how it's not anymore! Not anymore. And as upset as this makes me, as upset as I am to know that I don't have a belt around my waist or over my shoulder anymore, it upsets me. upset me as much as it should and I'm going to tell you why. Because on Friday night, May 
the 25th, right here, Des Moines, Iowa. It's the gauntlet for the gold. So sure. Eric Cannon lost tonight. Eric Cannon is no longer a champion in 3XW for now. Because on May 25th, when I throw out, when I beat up, when I eliminate 29 other men, at the end of the night, I will have my hand raised victorious. And I will be the 3XW World Heavyweight Champion. Are you into WWE or 3X Wrestling? Then we have the place for you to hang out every Monday night and Sunday WWE pay-per-view events monthly. The Keg Stand in West Des Moines at 3530 West Town Parkway. Every Monday night you can hang out with 3X Wrestling staff and wrestlers while we watch Monday Night Raw. Plus the monthly WWE pay-per-view events including WrestleMania, Royal Rumble, SummerSlam and more. Friend 3X Wrestling and The Keg Stand on Facebook and we'll keep you updated. See you at The Keg Stand for wrestling, drinks and great food from Bach Catering.